I'm Alison McNeil, Director of the National Junior Choir of Northern Ireland. This year we welcomed singers from all over Northern Ireland in our first ever online virtual course. The singers have had sessions on vocal technique, musicianship, they've taken part in creative challenges and social events and of course we've had rehearsals to prepare music for the release of our forthcoming music videos. I hope you'll enjoy this video which shows behind the scenes footage of our virtual course and our singers experiences in what has been a very different year for all of us. We very much look forward to singing together soon and performing for you in concert in the very near future. It's not every day that you'd get like, you know, like to do something like this. Not every day you get like an opportunity like this. So it's like, it's, and it also like just feels like that you've like accomplished something really good. Really fun because it's like my first time in the youth choir and I was really scared about it on Monday but like as soon as I got on like everyone was so nice and then it was so like, well organized it was really good. You get to meet new people and the instructors are really good. It's been stuck inside of my parents <laughs> a lot. I need to uh, start talking to people a lot more since um, we're stuck inside during these really difficult times and with being with the choir it's helped me realize that there are still people there to talk to and that everybody's doing this and eventually it's made me realize that it will be all over soon so we just got to keep pushing. Well I would just like to thank you all for such a great week and the atmosphere has just been so nice. The first day I came in and I didn't know what it was going to be like I thought it would be a bit harder over Zoom but it actually wasn't because the time slots and all the breaks and how it was worked and managed was really nice and we had new people and guests in every day and it was really good because you got to ask questions and there was time and even though we weren't together you could kind of feel the vibe that everyone was kind of there even though and I feel like because we're over in zoom not everyone's as shy because you're muted and you can sing your heart out and then whenever you go to record it it'll be really good because you haven't been you don't need to perform for anybody you just perform for yourself and then it'll be put into the video but I think it's really it's a really good experience for especially during lockdown because uh, I know me going, uh, went back to school and was really happy to see my friends and then now we had to go back into another lockdown for two weeks and then it, going on this and making all the use was just really great. I've enjoyed the sectionals, learning the songs and just getting techniques and just really improving my singing. It's been like amazing. With choir you hear everyone singing and you feel so much better because everyone's enjoying it hopefully and it's just so cool to see that atmosphere which is my favourite part of it to be honest. <laughs> At sectionals that's one of my favourite parts I guess because we get to sing through the whole song and that's when you kind of like hear how it really sounds and then with the backing track and it feels really good. I like this like the positivity given off from the songs I like how um kind of vibrant they are even though we can't hear each other singing we can still kind of like feel that like atmosphere of being in a choir We have musicianship sessions with Karen and it's really fun because we learn different things about music and how to read music and everything and she's great at teaching us that. Doing the um buddy bim, biddy bum, biddy bim 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 bum 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 that that song. She like loves getting me to do it. I don't know why. But anyway, <laughs> I really like like the musicianship classes because going into like the course, I couldn't read sheet music at all. And I feel like I've gotten a bit better at that. Yeah. 
Hello, Alison. Um, I think she's very good because she she gets um gets everyone up in the morning to dance and like do the shake it up, shake, 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 and all that jazz. And it's actually really funny because you're like the probably the most enthusiastic teacher on the course in the, at eight o'clock or nine o'clock in the morning to <laughs> getting everyone to dance and put bananas and apples and all on their heads and all that and sing about mangoes and wake everyone's parents up. So I think that's really good. <laughs> Get your apples or your oranges. Okay, and you're gonna put them under here. And I want us to practice our good posture. The timer is about to start. Get ready. On your marks, get set, blow. Now we see our contestants bubbling away there as they rapidly go to the finish line. Who will come on out on top? We've yet to see, we have about 20 seconds left on the clock. Connor Powell is a judge. We have Rihanna McGray, part one. She is doing very well. Come on, keep blowing. Alison McNeil is laughing at my voice. I don't know why. Maria Toll is doing quite well. Come on, Maria. Emily McCroachie is doing good. Oh, whoop, whoop. Yay, you all did it. <laughs> well done. I really enjoy the afternoon challenges just because you have you get to meet new people in the morning time and see them but then afterwards you still have things to do and they they always make you become more creative and think outside the box and think of new ways of looking at lyrics and just looking at the world around you yeah i did like um some canvas paintings there and a couple drawings for when i close my eyes i made a list of all the things that i was gonna i was gonna do for um the videos and I was really excited to get out of the house and like get creative. I like the afternoon challenges a lot because I liked the way we could have freedom to do anything we wanted and interpret it in our own way. This is for when I close my eyes. It's kind of nice to like take some time to think of like creative ideas and like just take some time on your day to just and it's quite like relaxed. Singing is a very joyful thing and being able to sing with other people in a choir and know that I'm part of something, um, it really, it helps with your mental health. I have absolutely love learning all the music. It's given me a chance. It's actually got me motivated to get up in the morning and a really good way to spend your time during lockdown because normally I'd just be sitting probably watching TV or something. So it's a really good motivation. I've been doing this choir um, since it started. Whenever I was 11, I joined first, and um, it was always good to sing in person, but then whenever it came on Zoom, it was it was honestly just as good. We're not just all sitting, doing nothing, when we, like, we've actually done something productive, and that it's not just another thing that we can't do because of coronavirus, we've actually thought of something that we can um, do to show our talent, and to bring smiles to people's faces. Really looking forward to um, singing, like with people again, you know, because there's that, there's just something great about standing on a stage and singing with people. And when you just know that you've like done it all and it's all your hard work and it's paying off. And it's just really, it's really rewarding.